Hey guys, it's Aaron Classic Gamer. We're going to play some shoot 'em ups on the old RetroPie. We're going to play some main, some PC engines, probably some Super Nintendo, NES, all sorts of good stuff. Maybe some Sega Genesis, some main, all sorts of good stuff. Some cave shoot 'em ups, amongst many, many more. So, we're going to be playing with the good old SNES Pro. SN30 Pro, pardon me, a Bluetooth controller by 8-Bit Doe. Let's give it one credit and let's see how far we can get here. This is Gunbird by Capcom. Let's try Tetsu. We're drinking some sake here. Died already. They're playing Gunbird 2 on the Dreamcast, so it's actually the first time I ever played this series. You can actually play the game in horizontal or vertical mode. Really, really cool. All right. Can't hold the button down here. We have to keep actually pressing it. We're playing this on main. Ah! Try the old bomb there. Use this controller a lot on Nintendo Switch. Really awesome controller. Very little input lag. Oh, come on! are just dying here. Alright. Finally got him. So we'll play a few credits here and just enjoy the game. Heat it up to sake, and you definitely don't want to drink that warm. I mean, cold. So, got it warmed up right now. It's kind of lukewarm right now. Definitely does not taste as good cold. thought about doing this live stream on uh, YouTube Gaming, or YouTube I guess, they don't follow YouTube Gaming anymore, but uh, well, I said the hell with it. Twitch seems to be a little easier to set up. And it kind of archives them weird if you put your games on, uh, you know, on there as a live stream. Oh, that was stupid. We about had him. Oh, well. Some really awesome music in this series. Only that 90s Japanese charm.
Oh no. I think this will probably be my last credit on this game, guys, and we'll move on to something else. Should have hooked up the arcade stick for this. Alright, that's gonna be it, guys. Let's go ahead and jump out of this game, and we'll jump into another. Play each game for five or ten minutes. Keep the game going fast here. Let's uh, check out uh, some of the Darius games. There's Dio, that's a cool game. Alright, let's check out some Darius 2 if it'll play. This is really cool in the 4K widescreen. All the Darius games are. Definitely with a larger widescreen. I played it on my ultra wide monitor on my PC, and that is something to behold, guys. This looks spectacular. Real cool stereo sound here. Such a cool series, guys. I was a big fan of the Darius games on the Super Nintendo. Oh, come on. We are not playing too good. Let's give it another credit, why not? Ah oh, man. A lot of screen real estate to contend with here. All right, we beat the boss. At least I had thought I did. Holy crap. <laughs> That's cool. Automatically turns there. We're just playing flat out lousy, but that's okay. Tons of fun. But well, cool graphics, guys. And this is like, there'd normally be two or three monitors here set up for this game. But the multiple branching paths, it would cost you a fortune. And you, and you would never just, you know, get to the end of this game on one credit. At least the way I play. <laughs> 
Oh. So obviously where it gets much, much more difficult. And without the power-ups that I don't have, it is quite difficult. That's okay. Wow. <laughs> That's going to be it, guys, for that game. Let's uh, go to the next shoot 'em up. Really cool. Darius Gaiden. Silver Hawk. I don't think that one actually plays very good. Let's see. Let's try out Dio. That's a cool game. From like the mid 90s. Scramble. All right. By Athena from nineteen ninety three. Definitely ahead of its time. Looks really good. Uh, nice graphics. Fun 90s music. A lot of speed there. Kinda reminds me a little bit of Truxton. With all the power-ups. slow down when we use the bomb there. I'll try to go for the high score here. It'll all depend if we can beat this boss here. because I was getting ready to die. <laughs> but we got through it. We got a 10,000 bonus there for clearing the stage. I think this game is supposed to play in mono, so the sound plays a little weird here on the retro pie. That was one credit, guys. They beat my all-time best there. That's cool that it saves that. Definitely a cool shoot 'em up, guys. Let's see what else we can find here. How about we play something on the PC Engine? Or... It's TurboGrafx CD. I don't know if there's any shoot 'em ups on here. There's Super Air Zonk. Superstar Soldier. Let's check out Superstar Soldier.
Definitely a fun game. I haven't played that in a long time. All right, by the PC Super Engine CD-ROM 2 system. And it looks pretty good. Of course, you're not worried about a disk drive here. It's all solid state, of course, with the with the setup here on the Raspberry Pi. It's definitely a cute em up. There's Bomberman. Let's try the Pero Caesar here. Oops. Got some homing missiles there. Definitely a cute em up. Uh, interesting though. Pretty smooth controls. Some decent music here. Definitely a lot of fun. Little known game for sure. Definitely not one of the most uh, difficult shoot em ups that you'll see. on our first credit here as you can see it doesn't really take away too many lives too quick it's like blazing lasers once you get on a roll man it's just pretty hard to get derailed off of it There we go, that's a cool weapon. We're up to 40,000 here. Hit pause here and have a quick drink. Looks like we're coming up on the boss. Oops. Whoa. So, we died. Finally died. Hopefully it's not going to make me do the whole stage again. Looks like it's going to, though. Yep, the whole damn stage. So if we die again, we'll probably just call it quits. I can just see this being very difficult to utilize all the lives. I believe it makes you go through the whole stage. How cheap. Probably just isn't very long and uh, the game and it would just add a lot of longevity to the game by... I don't know. 
might continue to do this, I guess. Definitely a cute game. See, now we can get even another heart here. Give us another life. Feels like forever to get back to the boss. So I'm not sure how to beat these guys. Was it man I definitely overthought it huh so we're up to five lives now <laughs> we're pretty much invincible at this stage Yeah, definitely just isn't very challenging. I'm playing a lot of my pinball machine now that I have finally have it fixed. Good old pinbot, so check out those uh, videos there up on the channel about the pinbot. Alright, looks like we've got ourselves another boss here. Oh no! Oh good, it didn't let me start over. That would have been horrible. Stage one? Oh my gosh. Wowza. Alright, that's as good as a stopping point as any. There's Bomberman. Holy crap, holy Batman. Let's check out another shoot 'em up. There's the Valis games, the E's book one and two. The E's three. Absolutely awesome games. So we played a cute em up. Let's play something different. Some Lord of Thunder on the Sega CD. 
Maybe after this we'll go and play two or three cave shoot 'em ups. Add a little variety here. Definitely a lot of fun to be had here on the Retro Pie. Now we're rocking out with Lords of Thunder. Ninety-five by Hudson South. Let's go to Azal or Azal. I don't know. Let's go with Wind Armor. May I help you? Lots of cool RPG elements there to upgrade your ship. That's the bomb. I can't remember what the... There we go. Whoa. I thought this was really cool because it has like a beat em up element to it. So it rewards you to get up and close and personal. It's almost like a Gundam game almost. Really awesome music. up speed here. It's a little crazy. Shows the true power of the Sega CD. A little slow down here and there, but nothing terrible. there. Music is definitely badass. Oh no! stuff there. That's crazy.
So you just go from land to land kicking ass. May I help you? Thank you. I forgot how badass the music was in this. Cool game, guys. Two. That's it, guys. That's Load of Thunder. Just kind of want to listen to the song here a little bit. It's pretty badass. This awesome guitar rift here. Alright, so we've got to move on from the awesome badass music there. Might as well go and play another awesome shoot 'em up. So, search no further than the cave shoot 'em ups. Where, oh, where are you? Most of the cave shoot 'em ups are on here. The ones that are any good, anyway. Let's just start off the top here. Let's play some Air Ga Galley. Or I think it says Air Garrett when uh, you play the game. I've got this on my Multicade. Really cool game, guys. Drink a ton of sake out of my Legend of Zelda cup. Air Garrett blows your socks This is socks by off. Ban Presto and Gazelle from 1996. What the heck? Don't yell at Oh no! Some of these games don't work too well with the Bluetooth controller, and this is one of them, guys. You should play the wire controller on this one. And it's not ideal playing these games with the Bluetooth controller. What the hell? Oh, we jumped out of the game. Oh, well. I think we did a reset by accident. Thing on Feveron's pretty cool. Hmm. How about Ketsu Kazuna Jigoku Tachi? Really cool game. This is a later cave game. Tons of action, guys. Unfortunately, there's only one credit you can play on this game, so I haven't seen the whole game. About 2002. 
It's a little slow down here, here and there, but uh, you know, it kind of pushes the retro pie to the limit. Definitely a bullet hell shooter you will see here shortly. Tons and tons and tons of bullets on the screen. Tons of enemies on the screen, it's just out of control. Oh no! Tons of power-ups, you die, you're basically screwed. got through a ton there. Are you ready? Yowza. Never played this actual arcade game. Alright, so I had one life to spare. It's one of my favorite shoot em ups, guys. I uh, just discovered it here recently, probably about a year or so ago. But man, just tons of gameplay. Super fun game. It's just a cool game. Unfortunately, I was talking, not paying attention. We came in fourth. Really cool game, guys. No matter if you play one coin or not, it throws you out of the game. I don't know if there's a way to change that or not. But definitely a cool game, guys. Even if it is only one credit each time. Did get the chance uh, yesterday to play for the first time Don Pachi, however you pronounce this title. Daojo version 101. I played it on a really cool uh, Japanese style arcade machine. You know, you sit down at it. Can't think of the name right now. Uh, but definitely a cool game. Go ahead and play it just to relive the experience a little bit. Played it with uh, total arcade controls there, of course. It's a three button game. But you were actually allowed to do continues on that. So I'm guessing they changed uh, some of the dip switches there. But very, very neat. This also came out in 2002. This game also, at least the version I have on MAME, uh, here I cannot do more than one credit, which is a damn shame. I would love to beat this game. Uh, probably take. 150 credits knowing my luck because I don't have the skill that a lot of other dedicated people do. I guess I could utilize the save states and uh, try to get a little farther in the game, but meh. Kind of like just doing the one credit and seeing how far I can get.
course, Cave is the master of shoot 'em ups. A lot of shoot 'em ups that aren't on this, like Ibarra and Ibarra Black, uh, are two versions of that game that come to mind that aren't on here. But uh, that came out in the mid 2000s, and I don't know that this has the power to play it, even if I wanted it to. But uh, definitely plays awesome. As you can see, I mean, it, it handles this game pretty pretty well. Ketsu is a little more intense. A few more bullets on screen. tell the Japanese they really know how to make one hell of a shoot em up oh no I had no bombs that sucks because I was almost done man that would have been cool oh well Would have got a really awesome clear bonus too. This arcade I went to is called Tapper's Arcade. Uh, about three, four hours from my house, but uh, it's all free play. As long as you buy drinks, they don't care how long you stay. And everything's set to free play, at least the arcade games. Pinball machines are, you have to pay for them. You know, it's 50 cents to a dollar a play, but uh, all the arcade games, and they've got a pretty good variety. They've got a few Japanese games, a lot of classics. Um, uh, but it's all free to get into and to play, so definitely a cool thing. I'm going to have to show up again sometime soon maybe take the camera with me they've done a huge arcade expansion they're doing uh, a lot of uh, uh, cool stuff like tournaments with uh, uh, Super Smash Brothers Ultimate oh what a hard pattern that was. And we didn't even scratch the top five, guys. Definitely a fun game, though. I wish... I'm going to have to get into the dip settings here and figure out how to do that. Plug a uh, keyboard in here and just see how... Just figure that out a little bit to change this from one credit. Because the Don Pachi games are awesome. Been playing for about 43, 45 minutes here. There's Do Don Pachi 2. There's Do Don Pachi. There's Don Pachi. Game's definitely pretty simple. Let's go ahead and check it out, though. Get a nice break from the difficulty that was Do Don Pachi, however you pronounce the rest of it. Versus by Atlas and Cave. Okay. Wing luck. leader to base. Wing leader to base. Wing leader to base. Commencing operation. Three, two, one, go. A lot of the same Enemy out. controls of the original. I'm gonna go for a high score here. Try to get million point game
Oh no! this game in a way because it doesn't have the life bars that all the others do. Alright, I shouldn't use that bomb, but I thought I was going to die there. Sixty-seven thousand one hundred ten. Ah, man, so much for the million-point game. Game over. Definitely a decent score, but thanks for playing this game. Bye. Yeah. Don't botch. Let's go at like it again battle. here. Okay. Open up another Good beer luck. here. Wing leader to base. Wing leader to base. Commencing operation. Three, two, one, go! I don't know if I can get through this first game here. First stop. This Any first out. level. Let's see what you got. Might be able to do it. I know I've done a million point game in this before, so it's very doable. Oh my god. So much for that, huh? Up. 
Definitely going with an unfamiliar ship was not the way to go. That's enough of Don Pachi. Man. Game over. I was hoping I'd get a million point game, not today. Thanks for playing this game. Bye. Bye. First, 867,000. That's gross. We can do better than that. Oh, well. How about... Some Aspaguluda. Really cool shoot em up. And I think next we'll play some Star Force on the NES. This game came out in 2003. Really beautiful game. Lucky.
Oh my gosh. That was ridiculous. Leave it at that, guys. A lousy one crit a game, but that is all right. Super fun game. Let's play some Esrade. You're this guy, and you're flying around kicking some ass and chewing some bubble gum. But we're all out of bubble gum. Your friends are dead. Oh my gosh. Let's fly around and kick some ass. What? We reset. Sorry. Oh well, let's try this one again. Oh, we start out at a different spot. That's cool. I've never played this one before. Not doing too good, huh? This, this game would take a barrel full of quarters to be able to be really cool game, though. Maybe we just have to give it coins at the beginning. Holy shit. Ah. Guess if you hold down on the fire button and the coin button, it restarts it. She's definitely not as powerful, but she's a lot more nimble.
think I like the first mode better. It seems like a little more well-rounded. Tough as nails. Let's check out something else. Why not some Dodon Pachi to B Storm? Tell you one thing about that sake, man, it catches up with you. It's not going to launch, apparently, so let's go ahead and play some Dodon Pachi. Every once in a while on the Retro Pie, you got a game that will not launch. This will probably be our last game, guys. I don't know that this is Don pa Do Don Pachi. I think it may be Don Pachi. I don't know. Anyway, let's play and see how far we can get here. Star Force, that'll be my next game and last.
game over. over. Dodon Pachi. That was Dodon Pachi. My bad. Let's go play the NES game. Super cool game, guys. The arcade game is tough as nails. So much fun. Classic by Tecmo from 1987. Awesome graphics. Alice didn't make it on the NES Classic is beyond me. Tough game. Such a fan, fun game, guys. Oh, man. Ah, sent me back quite a bit. We're not doing too good here, guys. Oh my gosh! A game over at 61,100. Guys, we've been playing all sorts of shoot 'em ups. We played on the NES, we played MAME, all sorts of arcade games there, some PC Engine games. Tons of fun. Super Nintendo and Genesis, watch out, because we'll play you one of these days. Ha ha ha. Please remember to like, subscribe, and comment on the YouTube gaming website. And as always, guys, check us out on Twitter and Twitch. Peace and happy gaming.